lockdown ride today. Heated socks. Give me an electric shock. The Ian bag. I just want warm feet. The COVID walkers, same as COVID cyclists. Oh, it's soaking. Whoa, it's so slippy. Whoa. Oh, what am I doing? Hey folks, going for a local lockdown ride today. Just myself and Ian. Ian situated there, next to my sad light, which is now in the shed, bringing some lovely sun rays into my life, even though they're fake sunrise. 250 quid like that, found it in a charity shop for 15 quid, so I brought it in here. So a few things to show you today. Uh, one, I've got up here, see this is, the original backpack that Todd uses a lot, the little Evoc, and they sent me this one which is even smaller. This is literally the smallest one you can have. So I've got the 76 dry bag in there with my kit in, and then I've got what they have a new bladder. It's black, don't know why they made it black. Maybe it's so that the light doesn't get in it, I don't know, even though it's covered up. And then it's got a slightly different top here the way it opens. But the important thing, this is the thing I'm trying. These cost me 30 quid and they are heated socks. Now they're not waterproof, but they've got like an element running through them. They've got like a little, little pocket here. And then these go in. Uh, there you go. That's it, that's a little battery. There's your uh, indicator. Then you plug them in. They've got a wire. Where's that wire? Here. And uh, apparently they 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 can cope with being wet. And let's see, I tried them yesterday on a gravel ride, but my feet didn't get wet, and they just stayed nice body temperature. That's all I want. Don't care about warmth, just don't want them cold. So we've also got the big Ian bag here, which he'll jump in for the local just to go up the roads and stuff. Um, let's get ready. You ready? Ready to go? All right. So these things are sided. They're on. And they just go under the knee pads and you just open up here and there you go you've got what do we do press that there you go red orange green obviously we're going to go for red the warmest possible apparently they last like four to five hours so let's see and then that will be hopefully covered up by, well it will be covered up by my race trousers there and hopefully won't short out and give me an electric shock so one thing I've realised because it's on orange which means 50% uh, I left the extra battery on here and just charged the battery in its port the other side thinking it would trickle charge into there and charge the main battery but I think well, all it does is it charges this so uh, yeah, that one, the main battery is on orange, but that's full, which you can see here by those lights. Bit weird, but what I know now is I need to charge them separately. And also if you wonder why there's quite a bright light when I'm riding today, coming from here, it's because I uh, crashed the other day and broke off that little bit that goes there. It should look on Todd's like that. There you go. But that's on its way to me. They were like straight on the case. Yep, yeah, we'll send you one of them. Ready to roll. The Ian bag is engaged. I've got the, uh, the warm over bits on my gloves because it is cold. It's like two, three degrees today. There we go. <laughs> Come on then, Ian, let's get you to the local. Wow. How's he looking? Ian. All right, how's that, mate? killing my shoulders because I've got the little backpack underneath this big backpack. It's about two miles and we'll be there. Oh man, my shoulders. 
Time to stash Ian. <laughs> Not Ian, the bag. Stash the bag. Time to get on the trail. Right, we have. Oh, Ian's having a poo. Engaged uh, trail mode, medium. I don't actually know what they call it on Rocky Mountain. Any Rocky Mountain people out there, tell me what they call it, the middle mode, orange. Um, nice get up there. Come on, son. Don't want to go too fast, you're going to knacker him out. But he is super fit at the moment. So the plan with these socks, basically, today, is through all the puddles, get my feet soaking wet. I don't give one shift about wet feet, I just want warm feet. No denying that it's super wet and crappy today. I just feel the water seeping into the top of my left foot. So these heated socks, they basically heat around your toes, which obviously is the, I think maybe under your foot as well, but some of them don't do under your, under your toes. I mean, that's a bit, isn't it? That's the extremities. <laughs> oh dear. It makes me laugh, all these like, call them the, the COVID walkers, same as COVID cyclists. Ones who normally wouldn't be out. And they come places like this, it's really busy then. It's not normally. But they walk miles round all the mud. It's like, just get the right boots on. Right, I'm going to do a trail here. I've just noticed. I hardly ever ride it. Wow. Look at that. Look how white the hills in Wales are looking. I wish we were there right now. I think this is it. Let's just get straight in and get on with it. Oh, the brakes. The brakes have gone in. The back brake is going right in. <laughs> On there. There's air in there. I just uh, changed the pads the other day. Hopefully it'll be all right now. Ah, go down there. Nah, I'm not going to do that one. Yes. Yeah. Go there. There's a lot of trails here I don't ride normally. This seems a bit more XC. Oh, nice. Way. We're back on the same climb I came up. The mountain bike incoming on the steep climb. Look how fast you catch them. I'm in ludicrous mode. Alright mate. Thanks a lot. How you doing? Right, yeah. On the classic, oh, we used to call it the Todd downhill. It's a little section here. Used to bring him. He's really young. Where he learned to do this drop off in a sec. A couple of little jumps. Certainly uh, no challenge to him now. Oh, that's with some water in the sock. Oh, I can feel it cold on the top. So, hop. Oh, it's soaking. Full oh, the puddles. Nice. Which trail shall I do first? This side. Might do eucalyptus. Not called that. I give them my own names. Just because it's a nice long fast. Probably one of the fastest trails on this side. Actually it might be called Enduro Magsome. I might have named it. But anyway, here. There's a trail that goes off. To the right there, and we go left. Might come back up and do that trail in a sec. Oh, it's not 
just have that e-bike drive in these wet, muddy conditions. Keeping you going. Whoa, so slippy. Keep it going. Should let some air out of tires, really. But then, not too bad, a bit of slick, slidey. Uh, practice. Let's see. Woo! When I was racing, the Enduros, this is the track I used to come from the local. I absolutely sprint the hell out of it. Always trying to better myself in Strava. Just don't have that inclination anymore. When it's like this, as long as there's nothing too rough on the sides, you can use the grass for grip on the long turns. You just hope there's no stumps. Oh. Yeah, again, sorry about the noisy brakes. Uh, I've still got the trick stuff in these, trick stuff pads in my XT4 pots. Put them in both bikes. Todd did two rides, admittedly very steep tech, and he was on the brakes a lot. But after two rides, he got one set of pads on the rear right down right down to the metal so i put his front one in the back of this because the back of this had worn out a fair bit in two rides and uh well let's see how they are still squealy aren't they right letting a bit out aiming for three psi <laughs> jump to that eh? the reason these brakes are a bit naff at the moment is because they're old saint ones that i've just put on it and i didn't spend much time bleeding them so another job, another job for the shed. Right, let's do this same trail from before. But um, you know, how's it gone? Let's set it up. Here it is. <laughs> same trail from before. But the right hand line. Good fun trail. This very very old. We were a part of putting this in in the olden days. Brakes are annoying me. Whoa! <laughs> what am I doing? Got my weight wrong then. Nowhere near enough speed to get that one. You know what? I'm going to go back up. Do this again. That was so rubbish. Right, let's see if we can hit this with a little bit of finesse. Rather than like I've never ridden a bike before. Yeah, nice angle. Got that for this. Tap the back end of it. Oh, there we steer there. Tight turn. That's the one. Very slick, very slick. Yes, oh, that was good fun. Oh, I'm going back up a trail. Very quiet trail, so I can see ahead. I'm in ludicrous mode, so no worries on power getting me up here. All right, another trail coming up, one from the olden days that uh, we worked on. Probably 96, a whole while ago. Oh, there's one there as well. Oh, cool. I'll go with that one in a minute. We'll do this. The original one first. Woohoo. 
This has always been here, yeah it has, I used to ride this but it looks like people started riding it again, whoa! I've definitely got more grip, but it's still slick, that's for sure. Nice! Whoa! <laughs> that's deep! Right, let's go back this way. Oh no. Oh, I thought it was at the end. Through the slop. It's just like a flattish XC trail. And this can take you literally around the whole perimeter of this place. And I do, uh, that's what I've been running. Trying to get a bit fitter and trying to get Ian fitter. The five mile muddy XC run. Really enjoying it actually. It is so wet though, this part of the hill. Horrendous. And any of you say, oh, these e-bikes, they're all right, so you get them in loads of water, they start going wrong. Well, check this ride out today. And then let's see, shall we? Never do what I've just done. You get an hour in, and then you realize you haven't had a tap of your drink yet. Let's make sure my me, me new pack works. Mm-hmm. Good old active root winter mix. Tastes like mince pies. There we are. Viewpoint. Rammed with people. At least this one's quiet. Some Egypt moving their mask. Nice. Wales looks cold. <laughs> cold enough for you. Do a decent trail. Come on. boy <laughs> all right all right are you have another go at that i've just realized why my left foot was so cold the <laughs> left one wasn't turned on so i turned it off on oh, now, I actually feel it starting to warm up. It's amazing. Oh. This isn't too slippy. Ah, it's all right, it's fine. This is the slippy one. Oh my god, that looks horrible. Hmm. Go.
on it. Brilliant. Yeah, pretty buzzing, I got that. Whew. Okay, foot report, Mark 3, and the coldness of my left foot is pretty much gone. And they just feel, they don't feel warm, they feel like body temperature. And it is absolutely amazing. Wow. Finally. See how long it lasts now, eh? Right now, this is a track I've only just recently discovered here. And it's really good. Thank you. Cheers, mate. Proper, fast, and actually pretty gnarly, especially down here. Very wet at the moment. Wow, this will take the shots out. Whoa, you just made that turn. Man. The water has got a hell of a track in it. Nice. Brilliant. Love it. Down to the red now. That'll uh, teach me to not charge up the overtime pack and the battery separately. So uh, the lacking on power battery that wasn't charging the down tube has obviously sapped all the power from the overtime pack. It's now in the red. So riding on eco now. Try and get home. Hey folks, how's it going? Just sat at home editing this and realised that for some reason my outro filming didn't work, so just thought I'd do it from the office. Ian is fine, he's enjoyed himself, he's a bit knackered. The bike was fine with all that water, no worries. The socks, very impressed with them, really happy about that. Um, finally, no more cold feet. Well, let's see how long we last. I'll put a, a link in the description for where I got these off Amazon if I can find it um, and also in the description we've got links to our affiliates where you can buy some of the stuff we use at a cheaper rate and then there's our website for the merchandise so check that out give us a comment tell us what you think about this tell us what you think about the socks also like subscribe if you're subscribed you can become a member by clicking join thanks for watching see you in three keep it pinned Whoop!